Hello, this is Carlos and I am Linda. We are living in our floating house Mirni Oken. Welcome in our YouTube channel 22 South, where we invite you in our dream for a circle navigation. That's the prize we win! And now, I believe we have arrived to paradise for real. Welcome to Chagos. The archipelago is about 500 km south of the Maldives and 1,800 km east of the Seychelles. The Chagos group is a combination of different coralline rock structures topping a submarine ridge running southwards across the center of the Indian Ocean. Since 1971, only the atoll of Diego Garcia is inhabited and only by military and civilian contracted personnel. The Chagos archipelago was home for the Chagosians for more than a century and a half until the United Kingdom evicted them between 1967 and 1973 to allow the United States to build a military base on Diego Garcia. Around 2,000 people lived in the Chagos Islands, a Creole population originally from Africa and India. They had schools, church, hospitals, jail, even a railway. With all this history and stories about the islands, I go and explore this amazing place. This is a very mysterious place. And this looks like a church. It just feels very good to eat the fish that you catch in a barbecue in the middle of the Indian Ocean with your hands. Very important. We just think with this little moment we are just thinking about our patriots who contrib contribute to in this adventure. Thank you very much. For the other people who want take part of this adventure you can check our patreon page under in the link in the description Sir 
searching for things unspoken We can't hold this token On our way back to the boat, we were escorted by some of the beautiful birds flying around us that live on these islands. want to share with you quickly we have two like puppy two new puppy they love me and and they are turning around we notice that the wildlife is less afraid by the human they don't know what we are we are going fishing Oops. Spear fishing and scuba diving is forbidden in order to protect the conservation of Chagos environment, but fishing by rod or line for your consumption is allowed. And without any fresh food available, I was going to make the most of it. While I am out finding food for a great dinner, Linda keeps working in editing videos, but guess what? She's not alone. Big smile. Yeah, we got what we wanted. Really? A tuna. Tuna. Wow, good job, darling! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what an incredible colors! Yeah, I was taking many pictures. Unbelievable! Wow! Like, That's your tuna delivery you lady have ordered for tonight? <laughs> yes, exactly. Okay, that's the one. <laughs> we have a lua that is a champion. The Lua of Juanito! Lua of Juanito! Yep! Our friend from Maluluba! Very lucky to have every time I go out, every time I come back with a fish. It's unbelievable! So what are we having tonight? We are having... Sushi! Sushi party! Let's try! Chagos is definitely one of the best places we have been in our circumnavigation. 
Every day we were living the life we imagined when we said let's sail around the world, discovering incredible places, being surrounded by amazing marine wildlife, being completely in the wild, being self-sufficient, exposed to situations that represent new challenges that will make you grow, and doing all this while crossing oceans. Thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done it yet and see you next week bye be careful the hook Ola. darling go back And people before used to live here, so I'm um, yeah, hear noises. Want to pass